Hello everyone, you're welcome to the channel. This is MC Smart Homes and I'm Clay. Today we'll be doing yet another review on the channel. During our last video we did our very first review on the channel and that was the review of the major gateway. It was really fascinating. Thank you for all your comments and your uh, feedback. I was glad to read from you. Today we will not play around with the play around. No time to check time. We're getting straight right into our next review. And today we're doing a review of a really, really tiny device, which is the major door and window sensor. This very tiny device is used to detect when your door or window is open or closed. This is the sensor and this is a magnet. And this is how this works. You mount e either of this on your door shutter and the other on the door frame in very close proximity so that the, mag the magnet produces a magnetic field which your sensor reads and is able to tell whether your door is open or closed. So when this is in very close range, your sensor reads it as a closed door or a closed window. So when you open your door, it reads it as an open door or an open window. So the magnetic field is cut off and so it no longer reads it. Or for doors or windows that open this way, the magnetic field dies out till it's, the sensor is no longer able to read it. And it sends the signal as an open door or an open window. This too you can use in very um, beautiful ways like uh, mount it on your wardrobe shutter. You know, sometimes it's dark inside so you can install, you can mount um, a light strip or a bulb, however you choose. And automate this so when you open your, your, your wardrobe doors, your, the light comes on inside your wardrobe and that is really really cool i use these two devices on my door so i'm able to do automations once my door is open let's say after six the assumption is it's dark in the house so once um my gateway reads that the the door sensor is in the open position after 6 pm it turns on my light bulb Sometimes I use the double authentication. I use the door uh, sensors, but also I use the motion sensor. So that it is, I'm sure that I didn't open the door and stay outside, that I opened the door and actually moved into my house. So the motion sensor detects that the door opened and someone moved in, so it turns on the light. This tiny device uses the Zigbee protocol Remember from our last video we did, we said the Zigbee protocol is a low power protocol. So this device has a battery which runs on it. So you can see it has no power outlet. It has a battery inside which you can take off and replace. This device also would push notification to your phone that is through the gateway every time the door is open or closed so you can go to uh, the me home app and you see the last time your door was open the last time it was it was closed and so you can see the state of your door whether it's open or closed or if you have many of them running you can see which of your doors is open which is closed or which window or so you know what actions to take typically i use this for my lighting so I have an automation that when this opens, when my door opens, the my, my light bulb should go off. So let's see if this automation works. See that? It works. So I can set another one, another automation. If door closes, then turn on turn on 
the light bulb. Okay. I save that. So we try both now. I close, it comes on. I open, it goes off. Close, on. Close. This is how I use this device. Please leave a comment on the comment section. I would like to read from you. Subscribe, push the notification button. Share, please. Pass it with another person. Let them know about smart homes. They may just be very intrigued as I am about smart homes. And I'll see you in the next video.